The Cabal. War, wanted or not, is all they understand. And so we taught them. Sand Eaters, scattered. Dust Giants, felled. Ice Reapers, buried. Siege Dancers, broken. Until we grew complacent, and Gaul drove a blade between our ribs, left us gasping. Before the Vanguard showed them that the light cannot be tamed so easily, I should have stepped forward, stamped the Red Legion into extinction. Instead, I ran the banner and watched the city's victories dull our edge once more. It should have ended before they fattened us, before they exploited us, before they forced us to lift up a murderer as our savior. Another Cabal warmonger now leads a fleet off Nessus. No more waiting. We will be there to put her in the ground. Even my people have a word for peace, but we do not use it often, or lightly. I wouldn't have summoned you if I was not sincere. Peace with the Cabal. The darkness crowds the edges of this system. The Hive serves it. You'll fall to one if not the other. My world did. Empress Keitel. I'm sorry for what you've lost. We have all suffered. I propose an alliance. Cabal don't ally. They conquer. She betrayed her father to Gaul. Don't think she won't put a gilded knife in your back too. My father was soft. He lacked ambition. As you do. Humanity won't survive unless the Commander expands his horizons. Join my empire. You'll keep your title and gain a seat on my war council. With my army and your light, the Cabal will crush the Hive. Then, the Black Fleet. Bow. No. Very well. Ready yourself, Commander. I'll sharpen my gilded knife and see you both on the battlefield. Well done disrupting the Cabal on Nessus. I wish... That was the end of it. But unfortunately, it's just the beginning. Empress Keitel has emerged as the new face of their empire and demanded I pledge loyalty to her. Our conversation went as well as you might expect. Thanks to the information you recovered, we know this. Former members of the Red Legion and other leaderless cabal are all competing for a seat on Keitel's War Council. In an effort to prevent Cabal reunification, I'm assembling a team to take out her aspiring commanders. Lord Saladin will act as field commander, and Osiris will report directly to me as my advisor. He's appointed a new hunter, Crow, to be your reconnaissance expert. As always, Amanda Holiday will provide air support. Your task is simple. Defeat Keitel's commanders across the Soul System. Once you eliminate their leadership, Cabal infighting will prevent Keitel from amassing real power. If we miss this opportunity, another all-out war will become inevitable. 
Good luck. Well done disrupting the Cabal on Nessus. I wish that was the end of it. But unfortunately, it's just the beginning. Empress Keitel has emerged as the new face of their empire and demanded I pledge loyalty to her. Our conversation went as well as you might expect. Thanks to the information you recovered, we know this. Former members of the Red Legion and other leaderless Cabal are all competing for a seat on Keitel's War Council. In an effort to prevent Cabal reunification, I'm assembling a team to take out her aspiring commanders. Lord Saladin will act as field commander, and Osiris will report directly to me as my advisor. He's appointed a new hunter, Crow, to be your reconnaissance expert. As always, Amanda Holiday will provide air support. Your task is simple. Defeat Keitel's commanders across the Soul System. Once you eliminate their leadership, Cabal infighting will prevent Keitel from amassing real power. If we miss this opportunity, another all-out war will become inevitable. Good luck. Get ready to move. The Cabal have invaded the Cosmodrome. As we speak, Val Marag leads a charge into a hive nest, seeking revenge for what Zebo Arath did to the Cabal's home system. If he succeeds, Keitel is certain to promote him to her war council, and more Cabal will flood into the Cosmodrome. We can't let that stand. Not in the territory that produces some of our best guardians. Fortunately, our enemies are distracted. Cut through the chaos and take out Mirage. If we don't crush this now, we could lose an entire generation of new lights. Did I keep you waiting? I've been busy managing the antics of your commanders. Antics? Time-honored traditions. They don't concern you. You're auditioning members for your war council. I'd say that concerns us very much. Your commander could be a valued member of it, if he would accept my offer. You seem like a wise man. We both know that the best victory is won before the war even begins. I'm giving humanity a way out. Savala can end this now. You can end this now. A Cabal Empress with a penchant for mercy. It's a novel idea. You've learned from the mistakes of your predecessors, but I see how you lean on tradition when you fear a loss of control. I see your uncertainty dithering. As for what I know, I know that an empress without an empire is in no position to offer anything. The Cabal have lost their home, not their honor. If we are to die, we will take many with us. Tell your commander my patience is running out. Your orders remain the same. Honor or no, without a war council, she'll have no war. You're needed back on Nessus, Guardian. As if their tank wasn't enough, now we have Scions tunneling into Vex territory. According to Crow, their leader is Ixel the Far-Reaching. She's looking for something that will secure her a seat on the War Council. Something that will impress, like Vex prediction engines. Whatever Ixel digs up could give Keitel the winning edge. Or worse, simply unleash destruction on us all. Either outcome is to be avoided at all costs. 
ensure they never try this again. How did it go? Well, the Cabal are just thrilled we've been interfering in their politics. That said, a lot of them are just as unhappy Keitel tried to fold us into the Empire. Interesting. Another crack in the shield. Aren't you worried about retaliation? The data we've pulled from that prediction engine. We need to act now. That data represents possibility, not fate. We need to know more. Good, you're here. The science you broke up on Nessus are plotting something. Help Crow investigate this further. Wait. You aren't going to tell the commander? This concerns him. He deserves to know. My hope is there won't be anything to tell. Not if you and the Guardian see this through. Don't know about you, but I'll take that as a compliment. Nessus, Europa, the Cosmodrome. Every time the Cabal return to the battlegrounds, so shall we. Osiris has sent Crow undercover to investigate their plans for the Vex prediction engines. We need you back on the front lines. The more you can draw their fire, the easier it'll be for Crow to slip under the radar. And while you're out there, be sure to claim whatever you find in the aftermath. Weapons, gold... Without their home system, they can't resupply. And without supplies, they can't resist for long. Sometimes I like to listen to the city's pulse. I hear it best when the people are asleep, and when I'm alone. It was a warm night, and I wanted to feel the breeze on my face. I took a walk through the first garden we planted inside these walls, to remind myself how far we've come. We've made so many sacrifices since those early days, but with the green of that garden and the murmur of the city we built up around it, I could be at peace for a little while. Have you ever felt someone's eyes watching you, Guardian? You might not believe it, but I knew he was there before I saw him. I turned, and there he was, Aldrin Sam, his spirit haunting me. Then he shouted a warning, and something snapped in the trees behind me. I spun around, my gun in hand, before I realized I'd caught it. It all happened so fast. A cabal assassin, one of Keitel's, no doubt. When I looked back for Prince Eldrin, he was gone. Was it a troubled spirit? A hallucination? I wasn't sleeping well before. Now I'm not sure I will at all. There was an assassin within the walls of the last city, and no one knew until it was almost too late. Luck was on our side. Next time, it won't be. What we must do now is channel our light into a clean, burning fury and raise the Cabal Empire to ashes. Zavala may still have hope for a peaceful resolution, but he hasn't seen what I have. I'm still an Iron Lord. I'll be in the fray exacting retribution. When you're ready, you should be too.
there was an assassin within the walls of the last city, and no one knew until it was almost too late. Luck was on our side. Next time, it won't be. What we must do now is channel our light into a clean, burning fury and raise the Cabal Empire to ashes. Zavala may still have hope for a peaceful resolution, but he hasn't seen what I have. I'm still an Iron Lord. I'll be in the fray exacting retribution. When you're ready, you should be too. You were seen. At that distance, in the dark, no. Enough to put a name to a dead man's face. The commander told Ikora. Thankfully, he passed you off as a hallucination. An assassin was inside our walls. I had to do something. This isn't the first time an enemy has infiltrated the city. And it won't be the last. Your concern is noted, but far from a crisis. An attempted assassination isn't a crisis? Zavala is quite capable of dispatching a lone scion. He was distracted, soon to be lightless. If I wasn't unmasked, didn't the spider teach you that even small mistakes bring large consequences? I suppose you learned that chasing Zivu Arath. Choose your next words wisely. I should have kept my mask on, but I don't regret acting. I still think Zavala's in danger. That is why I'm embedding you as his bodyguard. Is that wise? We need to draw in their assassins, and a full security outfit is too obvious. Keep your mask on, always. Do not speak. Can I trust you to handle this with discretion? The utmost.